the chicken salad is, uh, well, this is chicken I flash roasted on top of the stove uh, last night and I still have a piece left, but I'm taking one piece and making chicken salad for my lunch. I'm going to put some onion in it. I'm gonna chop it up and then I'm going to use chipotle aioli for um, the sauce for this because this aioli is uh, has zero carbs so and I'm going to eat it in a lettuce in lettuce um, leaves so there's my lunch bowl with chicken salad low carb chicken salad and lettuce that is my lunch I'm going to uh, wrap bites in the lettuce. So I have this everything bagel seasoning that I got from Aldi a while ago. And I'm gonna season it with bagel seasoning before I bite it. So I'm going to show you what I'm doing here. I'm making some crab dip and I'm going to fill it into my, um, into my green peppers. Whoa, come on. I'm steaming them right now. I steamed them in some broth that I made yesterday when I was cooking uh, some chicken breast. So I, I thought I might add, get some flavor, extra flavor from this. So I, I decided that's how I'm going to cook it. Um, now I just want to make sure I can get them fixed and ready for their filling. I was trying to make it with the, whoops, stem on, but one stem came off and that's okay. So I'm going to fill the crab dip into these peppers. Now, I don't have... I only have three fourth amount of the of the crab that they they want me to use a pound. I don't need a pound. I'm going to use the 12 ounce package. So I'm also just going to use a three fourth package of cream cheese and other items that I need. Okay. Um, don't want to use the whole stick because I don't think I need it. So <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> I'm going to use a metal spoon there. Tomorrow is my twin's birthday. They'll be 15 years old. <laughs> Can't believe how time fly, flew. They were just babies. Okay. Okay. Just. I don't know. I think I might soften that in the microwave for us, like 10 seconds. All right. It's, yes, it's soft how I want it to be. It makes it good. I had it in the microwave for 15 seconds. And, but this is what I got. This is artificial crab. It's, uh, made with fish, Alaska Pollock, and I want to make the bites a bit smaller so they fit in my peppers better. I 
I'm going to put some uh, chopped onion in it too. I think it would taste delicious. Before I stir this, I'm going to go get the Old Bay seasoning to put in it to make it taste like crab. The recipe said two tablespoons, but I'm afraid it might be too salty if I put two tablespoons. So I'm just going to put about one tablespoon in it. All right. I'm going to go chop the other, the bit of onion I have and put some more cheese in here. Looking at it, I, th I think it needs more cream cheese, so I went ahead and put the whole block in. Even though I have only 12 ounces of crab. That looks good to me. Now I'm going to go chop the onion like I said. I'm going to put this uh, fr fresh chopped onion and fresh chopped red jalapeno in for flavor. Then I will go get some other cheese to add. Oops. <laughs> okay. I hope I can fit it all into my peppers. Alrighty. I'll put a handful of cheddar jack because that's what will help it stick together when it's cooked. I think it needs just a tad more to make sure it has enough. I don't want dip. I want a filling, a delicious filling. So I've got, I'm using the crab dip idea to fill those peppers because they don't always have to be filled with hamburger. They can also be filled with crab dip. It's breezy outside, but the air is very fresh and delicious. <laughs> this doesn't have to cook long because the peppers are already steamed. Believe my boys are 15. <laughs> that happened so fast. Okay, I'm gonna tuck, tuck it down in there more.
there. There's one in the oven now. I've discovered that my twins enjoy eating uh, cauliflower, cheesy cauliflower. So, since it's their birthday celebration, I'm making some today. Because they'll probably like to eat some. After I roast it in the oven under foil until it's very, very soft, I'm going to take it out and add the cheese sauce. So I ate two of my crab dip stuffed peppers and they were so delicious. Very delicious. I'm going to put the other two leftovers in the freezer. I have here some cauliflower with sausage in it and I'm going to make the cheese sauce. What I did with this cauliflower, I put it, I just salted it and put it in the oven and cooked it until it was all very soft. It's already fully cooked. So um, I just have to add the cheese sauce and top it with some extra cheese for uh, until, and then put it in the oven until the cheese is browning on top. And then I take it out because if I cook, too, cook it too long, the cheese will curdle. Since I already salted the, um, Cauliflower, I'm adding the no salt Tony Chacheries because I don't want to over salt I'll it. Put some red pepper flakes in it as well. I put some cheddar jack cheese in it because cheddar cheddar jack has more flavor than Kobe Jack. So I buy cheddar jack from Kroger now. Now that's a thick creamy sauce and it's going in. It w um, The white cheese I put in was cream cheese. First I put two cups of water, a cup of dry milk, and the block of cream cheese and then the seasonings, and then the big handful of Cheddar Jack. Now I'm ready to pour it over the cauliflower. So I tasted the sauce and I tasted the cauliflower and overall it tasted a little bit under seasoned. Um, I mean, it had a pepper, but it tasted lacking in salt. So I just added another sprinkle of kosher salt on top of it. I'm going to mix it and let's put it back in the oven. The sausage will add it, add some flavor in too. I normally put um, Velveeta in, but this time I just put cream cheese. Okay, my sauce is in. Now I'm going to top it with some more Cheddar Jack. I'm gonna add a little bit of crispy making? fried onions. What are you making? The casserole. It's cheesy and yummy. I'm going to add those on top for extra crunch. They are low in carbs. Three grams of carbs per serving. There it is, ready to go in the oven. It's all bubbly and ready to come out. There she is. I can't wait for it to cool off so I can eat some. That's going to be my dinner. And probably the boys too. Yes. Mimi, Mimi, and crispy topping, little bites of sausage. It's perfect this time. I was having trouble perfecting the recipe, but now I did. I can probably get three.